Lassie's got a, a wonderful array of product solutions that you can use that are external product solutions for laptop, desktop, professional, prosumer, personal. You know, my favorite drives are really those portable SSDs in the middle and, you know, some of these high capacities like the big docks and the stuff like this. So we're going to get into them. But before we get into that, let's cut back over to this shot because this gives us kind of an overview of what we've got here. So I want to go through this. This is the Let's see, rugged SSD, and I'm, I'm putting it on this pad on purpose because it kind of really shows you the grid lines, which are each an inch to really show you, you know, how big these drives are because they're really small. So this is the rugged SSD. The rugged Pro is exactly the same look. It's black and it's got a, a faster throughput because it's Thunderbolt 3. This is the Let's see, rugged right here, and this is their rugged family. This is the, 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 the mobile drive right here, and I'm gonna put this over this. So you can see it's really about the same size, a little different case. And these two I wanna get into, and I wanted to put them up here. This is the Lassie One Dock, and it's the One Dock with SSDs, and this is the Big Dock Two, and we're gonna get into those a little bit later in the show, but I wanted you to see a size comparison of how all these lay out before we went into the rest of the whole show. So let's start with the Rugged Boss SSD. Now the Rugged Boss SSD is a cool product because it's not just a drive, it also comes with the ability for you to transfer while you're on the road and transfer your files to and from. So content ingest and preview on the location and go. Now it's got a one terabyte SSD in it with up to 400 megabytes per second of performance, but it's a really cool drive, looks really neat. And I think it's very cool if you're on the road or out in the field and you're gonna to need to get your, your files on or off something into something, the Boss Drive is a great way to go. Next is the Rugged SSD. I've talked about this puppy a lot. This happens to be probably what, it, what is my favorite drive in the Lassie family. One of my favorite hard drives of all. I use one, the guys use them. We use them for all our uh, videos and stuff like that. What makes this uh, puppy that I love is you're getting over a thousand megabytes throughput. So this is able to handle 4K, whatever you throw it, it can do it. It is solid, I'm gonna drop it. We don't care. I know that was too big a bang. Sorry about that because this thing's rugged. That drop's not even going to hurt it in any shape or way. And if we can go to the top one, I want to show, you know, it's got this silicon gel around it. And it's just got one connector. It's that USB-C connector. But with that USB-C USB connector, we're getting over 1,000 megabits of throughput. So that's really incredible on what this does. Five-year warranty plus data recovery. And just Pull this up full page, look at the prices. Two terabytes for under $500, $499. The one terabyte's $299. The 500 is $179.99. But I gotta tell you, $299 for a terabyte or $499 for two terabytes, if you are a content creator on the go, this is the drive for you. Now, of course, some of us need even more throughput. And if you're doing really heavy, intense 4K work, a thousand isn't gonna cut it. You need to flood that bus. And the bus that you can flood is Thunderbolt 3, and this rugged SSD Pro will put everything it has on it. You get 2,800 megabits of throughput. It's gonna cost you a little bit more for that throughput. And once again, one terabyte for $399.99, two terabytes for $699.99. It is also USB-C compatible. So don't think that you can't use it with C, which I think puts that drive in a very unique spot because you get the maximum throughput of 2800. But if you don't have Thunderbolt 3, but you have a USB-C jack, say on your laptop or another one of your computers, you still get over a thousand. So very cool product, love it. The NVMe inside is runs super fast, super reliable, super drive. Next, the one, di one big dock SSD Pro, up to 2,800 megabytes. Why? Because there are SSDs in this puppy. Now, I'm picking this one up because I really want to show it off. I, you can, which camera you go to, I'll just look at. I'm going to follow you, Adam. Cool. This is the drive right here. It's a great drive. It's lightweight. You've got a card reader built into it, which is, imp which is impressive. With all the fastest, you know, it's got the really fast connectors in it for the faster media. And it's also got... Thunderbolt and uh, USB-C. And if we could show that upstairs, I want to just show how this, there we go, the jack panel on it. Uh, there we go, I'm trying to play with it, get the lighting the right way. So you've got your, your jacks over there. It actually is a dock as a unit. It's, it's lightweight, it's a cool product. I really think this is important for when you're, let's say, I, I want to call this unit not mobile or rugged, but it's certainly portable. It's something you can throw in a backpack or a bag or a suitcase and bring on you on the road, and you can absolutely be editing whatever kind of 4K storage, 4K footage you're working on. The two terabyte is $12.99, the four terabyte is $24.99. 
I love this concept of workflow if you're the real high-end uh, content creator. Now, if you're doing a long form, one hour documentary, yeah, four terabytes is gonna cut it for you. But if you're doing stuff like uh, commercials, little spots up to five minutes, maybe you're a YouTuber, but you wanna record your stuff in the best possible quality, even though you might not be streaming it at 4K, you know that if you get in the best possible quality now and upload it that way, you're gonna get the best results. So I really love the one big doc SSD Pro. I recommend it very highly, especially if you use it with either this drive or the black pro version just a great workflow in itself and it's just i love how they put the fastest you know c fast express c fast 2.0 and sd card readers in there just once again great job by let's say the one big doc not as fast you know it's only got a single drive and it's you're only gonna get 280 megabytes i can't recommend this for 4k workflows i can recommend it for people doing some hd stuff but what i can recommend it for is let's say you've got a laptop and you want to dock, and you want to add some additional storage at the same time. Well, this is a great way to enhance your just home organization of everything, even if you're not going to edit video on it. Up to 18 terabytes. I mean, this is insane. The 10 terabyte for 519. Now you can have this dock as part of your workflow with your laptop. You can archive all your videos off to the dock when you're done. And while it's not fast enough to edit 4K, you still put 4K footage on there because I want you to remember something. To edit video, we need the throughput that's capable of getting that data through in real time. But to archive and back it up, it's just ones and zeros, bits and bytes. You can back it up to a cloud, you can back it up to a drive that you keep locally. And this is a great choice for that, especially you take all your cards, you immediately back up the footage onto this puppy, and then when you're ready to edit, you move what you're gonna edit onto a faster drive. A cool workflow, here's the pricing starting at 354. To me, the 10 terabyte at 519, that's the real sweet spot. The two big dock Thunderbolt 3, this puppy, 490 megabytes, so you're gonna be able to do 4K compressed video workflows. That's this one right here. Let's go to one of those top shots again so we can show it off. This has two spinning drives in it, so you're gonna get massive amounts of size. You can see you've got your card readers here, and your card readers, a little bit more standard, your card readers. It's an SD and a compact flash card slot, but let's go to the back of this puppy because you've got the whole jack panel there that's got your USB-C and your dual Thunderbolt 3 ports. So you can daisy chain this sucker very easily. And what I really like about this is it's a great unit to have as a cornerstone of your HD and soon to be 4K compressed workflows. And it's got great prices when you need massive amount of storage. I mean, look at this, 20 terabytes for $1,004. Now, I'll have to tell you, I'm gonna to have to put a call in to the LC pricing committee again, because I don't understand why this drive isn't 999 for 20 terabytes, but Neither here nor there, I'll tell you what, if you call Oliver and you tell him you want the drive for $9.99, we're going to give it to you just because I said it on the show, and I'm sure I'll get in trouble for it, but I, we, we could do better on the pricing of this for sure. So that's the big Doc 2 Thunderbolt. Let's, uh, let's try to get these priced at price points. That makes sense. All right. The two big RAID, similar product. It's black instead of silver. doesn't have the dock. Gets you the same throughput, same performance everywhere else. 4 terabytes starting at 354, 28 terabytes up to 1104. So that's a great drive of a, of a basic RAID type storage, which you could do it as RAID 0 or RAID 1. Let's talk about that a little bit. Why would you want one or the other? Well, RAID 0 is going to get you the fastest throughput. That's when both drives are rated together against each other to give you the maximum throughput. Now, the risk is if either drive goes bad, you lose all your data. But once again, I'm not going to make me make you worry about that. Let's concentrate on the throughput and the performance that you get. RAID 1 means mirrored. That's where the two drives are, have the identical information on it, which is really great if you're going to be backing up and using it for archives. So if you had the 16 terabyte, you'd have two 8 terabyte drives mirroring each other. So if one goes bad, the other is there protecting your data. We don't have it on the desk, but the professional six bay desktop hardware RAID is a great unit. We've done some shows on that RAID before. What I really love about the C RAIDs is their RAID management software. I can use all six drives into one big RAID, or I can configure it into two drives and four drives in a RAID for whatever my needs are for whatever I'm doing. When we list the storage here, it's the amount of drives you have. So the 48 is basically uh, six drives of Eight, gig, eight gigabytes each, forgot how to do math. Uh, the, eight, the 84 is six times 12, and that's the kind of size that you have in it. It's, they're great drives, they're wonderful. 
Uh, you may notice when we go to the next slide, we're not going to show you the 12 bay. The 12 bays are not available anymore. The 6 bay is a great drive. And my hope is that in the future, maybe we get a 6 bay drive kind of like this one that's got a dock built into it too. So if you're watching the show, let's see, and I know the product managers are, give me a version of the 6 drive with, a, with, with some uh, card readers in it. I think that would be real exciting and real fun. You're going to get throughputs up to 1,400 megabytes per second. What I love about this is you can do RAID 5 for redundancy, which gets you more speed and redundancy at the same time, not like RAID 0. If you want to know more about RAIDs, we've done shows explaining the different RAID types, so I'm not going to go into it right now, but 6 drives at RAID 5 gives you a phenomenal non-linear editing, massive amount of storage to do work even in 4K. One of the things I want to mention also is that uh, Lassie really knows about the aesthetics of the drive, but they also understand that it's got to be super quiet too. So Lassie drives have uh, Noctua fans in them that keeps them really, really, you know, silent, enterprise class discs, five-year warranty. And like I said, I love how they have their RAID management software. I think it's super cool. Oh, next, almost forgot about this one. The RAID Rugged, the Lassie Rugged RAID Shuttle. I got marbles in my mouth, guys. I've messed up just about every other product name. I, I apologize for that, but up to 250 megabytes of transfer speeds, a great little portable drive. I like how they went with a flat rather than a stacked form factor because it fits a lot better like in a backpack, especially if you're a student backpack with a laptop on it. I love how it fits in that flat space. I wish I had one up here, but we're sold out right now. We'll get more in soon, but we don't have one in stock, so we, you know, we didn't have one that we could show you, but I like it. It can do RAID 0, RAID one great little unit like the way they, they they change the form factor on it and the rugged raid pro is two little drives rated on top of each other 240 megabytes per second transfer speed more traditional it's kind of like this drive but a little bit thicker you know because it's got the two drives stacked on it four terabytes for 249.99 and then just the the go-to drive what this is the the c rugged usb c you know it, it's the go-to drive if you're looking for a small portable drive to give you Ex extreme and extremely more storage at a low, low cost at an affordable price. Just look at it. One terabyte for $84.99 up to five terabytes for $179.99. So, you know, not a bad thing in the 130 megabytes for transfer speed. It's really not fast enough for anything more than, you know, compressed HD editing, but it's a great drive to back up all your stuff, your music, your photos, your files, and you can back up your video files on it too, or pull them off of your memory cards and put them onto it, you know, through with your laptop when you're in the field. Rugged Secure USB-C, very exciting. You know, security is becoming a bigger issue more and more every day, and people want to know that their drives have some kind of encryption on it. These drives do, 130 megabytes per second transfer speed, AES-256 hardware encryption, up to 2 terabyte capacity, $129.99, a nice little portable and rugged secure drive. And last but not least, the C mobile drives, you see them, you can find them at your Best Buy, you can find them at basically every single electronics and computer store in the world. Sleek design, lavish space, they look good, they work good. One terabyte for $74.99, the four terabyte at $144.99, five terabyte at $164.99. Great little products, very rugged, not as rugged as the rugged with the rubber cushions, but these still are very solid, work great, and they're a uh, two-year warranty. All right, so that brings us to the conclusion of our rundown of our Lassie product line that goes with our top five reasons pro content cr creators trust Lassie storage. I hope you like today's show. I hope you like the fact that I picked an orange shirt to match the Lassie orange color that goes with everything. If we could get a shot, we've got, if we get the P100 to, to show the, the, that, that shot on these drives, I just, I'm really excited about all these drives. I think when you see them all together, it helps uh, lay out a little bit. So I'm going to walk down all the drives categories we covered today quickly. So we have right here, we, we've got the, the rugged SSD. This is the rugged, this is the mobile, this is the SSD dock, and this is the two drive, big two SSD dock. Great products, love them. They do a great job. I can't speak highly enough about Lassie Storage. Lassie does a good drive, a good. There's a reason why you see these orange drives everywhere because they are really that good. And now I'm going to ask a little question for those people who saw the pre-show. I'm going to recap. Why are these drives 
orange and colored the way they are and shaped the way they are. And if you watched our pre-show, you know the answer to that. It's because the designer was inspired by an NBA basketball. So there you go. A little bit of trivia for you to end the show and to begin the show. I want to thank everyone for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube. Watch us on Facebook. Show the love. And remember, we have live people here. If you call 800-323-2325, we'd be happy to talk to you about the different C drives, the different sizes, configurations, your connectivity to put you in the right drive for your right budget, for what your needs are. You can talk to any of us. We're happy to help you out, whether you're streaming or video editing or a YouTube producer. Either way, your content needs to go on something, and the C drive is a great, fantastic external choice. So this is Gary from Video Guys. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you next week. Peace.